Hey you guys, Lissandra here, and today I want to do a special blog and all. So, pretty much, um, one thing I got sold is, uh, is these little memory cards. Okay, they're 32, uh, 32 gigabyte, again, Samsung, um, memory card adapter. And I got these other ones, they're just kind of cheap looking and all. But what I want to talk about is this, and this really pisses me off. You see all these? They're fake. They're counterfeit. Now, um, some of y'all may be wondering, what do you mean by counterfeit? And what I mean by counterfeit is this. These are pretty much scams, okay? And this is what I... Um, Whenever you're buying an SD card, uh, a jump drive, SD card, a micro SD card, you, sh you should be careful what you get, okay? And uh, one of the things they recommend you to do is the uh, uh, fake flash test to test if your memory, memory card is real or not, okay? Because the reason is this, and I kind of found this out the hard way. Um, back then, uh, some years back actually, before I bought, uh, before um, before I bought these cards, um, I, I used to like to buy uh, the latest, uh, latest and greatest uh, uh, memory card because. Uh, uh, I like I like the fact of having media on my phone. This is was before uh, all this deal with clouds and everything, you know. And uh, each time I bought, uh, bought one better, this four gigabytes, eight gigabytes, sixteen gigabytes, thirty-two gigabytes. Uh, it, it wasn't until like I started buying sixty-four gigabytes that I started realizing this. I put it on my phone and it would only load and it got corrupted and I thought well, maybe it's the type of card I'm using and all and um, and later on I bought a 128 then uh, it wasn't until like I bought a 256 uh, gigabyte memory card that I, I found this out uh, coincidentally uh, I just pretty much Google what was going on and um, that's when I found out the whole deal with uh, uh, fake memory cards and pretty much what they do these scammers what they do is this they get like a one gigabyte or they get or lower sometimes if you're lucky you might get a four gigabyte uh, what they do is they get smaller amount of memory cards they pretty much uh, do um, they pretty much configure it uh, to pretty much trick the device or drive that you actually have uh, what do you call it that you actually have the amount of store uh, memory storage that they claim they're saying in other words pretty much if uh, what they do is this they uh, they get um, four gigabyte and they um, they pretty much tri uh, configure it to trick the drive or whatever device that is 128 even though it's not and uh, pretty much when you start saving data if you don't if you save less than what the original card was you're fine you'll you'll never notice but when you get to the point where you surpass that limit uh, it'll either stop writing or it'll overwrite your uh, your first files and that's where the problem lies and that's um, that's pretty much what they do so pretty much what they did is that they did this fake flash test to test if these micro uh, SD memory cards are real or not and to my surprise a lot of the cards that I have bought in the past they turned out being fake it really pissed me off and it's unbelievable there's a lot of scammers like that out there so what I want to do and uh, uh, I want to ask for suggestions and all uh, if you see here I have a lighter here and what this is is 
pretty much this is a bench I kind of manufactured from like scrap wood and all because uh, mainly this is the table I use for like a lot of uh, uh, a lot of experiments that I, uh, I use and all. This is where I uh, pretty much uh, cleaned um, this is pretty much where I cleaned a rusted plier with hydrochloric acid so and what this is is hardy plank It's pretty much fireproof you can literally melt, uh, melt aluminum gold and a variety of metals on here and it, it, it can take the heat the only thing is it does get brittle after a while but anyway I want to ask y'all what's the best way to destroy these little uh, uh, these little shits okay and uh, I'm gonna post it I know that uh, sometimes I do get audience sometimes I don't so in case uh, in case I don't get any uh, replies or anything like that uh, I'll just pretty much like find uh, find interesting ways to destroy them and all but anyway um, I guess this is all thank you guys for watching please like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys next time bye